Hello guys, my name is Bogaji and welcome to my YouTube channel. So, um, Mr. Beast shares a, a story about how he almost died. And um, I think it's worth talking about. You can pick a thing or two from it. He basically... So he was driving with his two of his friends. He wasn't driving, he was in the passenger seat and then one of his friends was driving. He didn't mention the name of his friend, but he mentioned that Tyler was at the back seat. And they were on a highway, um, they were doing 100 kilometers per hour or 100 miles per hour. I don't know how US they interpret it, I think it's miles. Yeah, now the driver literally says, I don't think I'm feeling too well, and he goes like this. So he literally dies. It was, it was news to them because it was new, he had never seen that before. And the guy at the back also had never seen that before. So they were like, dude, what's up? They pinched him a bit and realized that he was gone because his hands were literally like that. And his head was, you know, he couldn't see, he couldn't feel. But his foot was on the accelerator. So he was driving at faster speed than he, uh, he, he, he were driving at a higher speed than before. So Mr. Beast was at the passenger seat and then um, he had to start controlling the steer, the steering wheel with his left hand. So he was trying to keep the, the car in line. But then again, he needed to get the guy's leg off the accelerator. So you see, and, and he mentioned that it was a big car, so it was difficult trying to reach over and once he bends down, he's not able to see the, he's not able to keep the car in line. So it was a bit difficult, but he, he, he eventually was able to do that. He got his, the guy's left, the, the guy's foot off the pedal. Now he had to brake because, and you know, once the car is driving at that speed, you can't apply the brakes instantly. Otherwise the car will somersault. That's Newton's, um, that's physics. A body continues to be in a state of motion until it's acted on by external force. I think that is Newton's second law of motion. I think I might be wrong, but there are three laws law one, law two, law three. I think this is the second law. It's been a while. I, I, I did feel this, so it's been a while now. So he needed to apply the, the brakes slowly and gradually, which he was doing. Now here, there's a twist here. The guy at the back was freaking out and he had to punch the dead guy over here. So he hit him so hard that the guy was gone like that. And that, he was freaking out. If he was, he was, if he had been in the passenger seat, they would have been dead. Long, long story short, what he, he said was that he was able to steer the car off the, the, the main road to um, a safer place just when he thought he was done the guy comes back to life and then boom he steps on the accelerator literally he died so when he came back he would he would just want to do what he was doing before he went out he didn't even know that he had he had passed out so he just applied it and then they hit uh, i think they, they hit a, a wall and then that brought the car to a halt but that was just it mr 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 beast was left with some bruises on his head and in the body whilst the guy, I mean, the guy even you know he had he had a condition, so they they went to the hospital. Did a lot of tests. Everything was fine. They didn't know. So subsequently, they were running some tests, and then the guy's heart just died. Boom, and that was it. Uh, that was when they realized, okay, so this is what has been happening. He the heart can stop at any time. So they are they fixed um, a cardiac pace pacemaker in his heart, which would always start the heart once it goes out if it was in ghana he probably be dead he no he would be dead no probably will be dead <laughs> i know for a fact but yeah that is it that's how mr beast almost died adios